Okay, now one of the questions that comes up is, is my child ready? I mean, we have a, a guy here that's fifth grade or so, we have an eighth grader, we don't know, are they really ready? Because we're not used to teaching algebra in the earlier than ninth grade ordinarily. Well, fact is, you've got a brochure, just take a look at the green sheet inside. Is your student ready for algebra? This is how we give you sort of a basic list of re prerequisites for getting ready to start. Do you know how to add, subtract, multiply, and divide with whole numbers and fractions and decimals? Those are the basics of arithmetic. Do you know a little bit about positive and negative numbers? That's what sign numbers are, positives and negatives. You don't have to know a lot, but you, do you know above zero and below zero on a thermometer? Do you know playing a game, getting points and losing points? I mean, that's positiveness and negativeness, right? Do you know how to change fractions to decimals, decimals to fractions? And do you know a little about how percent relates to fractions and decimals? I'm telling you, if students know that, if they have a basic understanding of that, and I'm not even talking about mastery, because very honestly, can you master something you don't really understand? No, you can learn to do it pretty quickly for the moment, but you haven't really mastered it. You can only master things you understand. So when they get to me and the algebra course, the video text algebra course, module A is going to reteach the fractions, the decimals, the percents, as if they've never seen them before, and we're really going to figure out why they work the way they do and where they come from and why it makes sense to do that, and then we're going to learn how to apply it to an algebra program. So you need to know if your student has gone through a program that's pretty solid conceptually, and there are several in the homeschool community, then you're probably ready to move right in. If you are looking at, if you've been doing a program where you've pretty much just been practicing the work, I've been trying to figure out why, you're just doing it, because that's what it told you to do. It's going to be a little more of a struggle. You may have to go a little slower when you get into the video text program, because in module A, I'm going to really drill down deep and find out why things work the way they do. I don't want you to be insulted. You're not thinking, well, why are we doing all this again? Because I want you to really understand. And that's really what it's all about.